morning everyone and welcome back to Music Box. My name is Georgia and today we're going to meet a very special instrument that spent most of its early life being played on the back of a horse. Can you guess what it is? Well, we'll get to that mystery in a minute. But first off, let's learn a new note. So we've already learnt Do, Re, Mi and So and send your voices up to La which is just above so. So instead of that flat hand that's facing us, we're going to turn our hand over into a curved shape. It looks kind of like a rainbow. Right, let's sing all of that together, shall we? Do, Re, Mi, So, La. Fantastic. Well done, everybody. Really good job. So we've got a short song this week that uses La and gets us a bit used to it. And it goes like this. On the Nile, crocodile, won't you stop and snap a while? Snap, 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 snap. Fabulous. So we're going to do some crocodile snapping with our arms at the end there. And in So's, Mies and Lars, it goes like this. A little bit slower. Ready and off we go. So la me, so la me, so la, so la, so la me. Snap, 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 snap. Great, and that snapping at the end there can be any rhythm you like. I've just chosen that one, but you can change that up any way you like, okay? Let's sing it with all the words. So, on the Nile, crocodile, won't you stop and snap a while? It's very short. So let's give it a go, shall we? And off we go. On the Nile, crocodile, won't you stop and snap a while? Snap, 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 snap. Fabulous work, really great. Okay everyone, for this activity let's stand up, let's be on our feet because we're going to need our bodies for this one. It's a game that uses a song and the song goes like this. Toe, knee, chest, nut, nose, I love him. Toe, knee, nose, toe, knee, nose, toe, knee, chest, nut, nose, I love him. That's what Tony knows. Okay, so it's a nice, easy, simple song. But it's got a few complicated actions to it, and let's get into that right now. So each of the words has their own action. So the toe of Tony is on our toes, knees on our knees, chest, nut, nose, I love him, toe, knee, nose, toe, knee nose. Toe, knee, chest, nut, nose, I love him. That's what toe, knee, nose. Okay, let's give it a go, shall we, with the song? Don't worry if it goes wrong the first time, let's have fun with it. Ready? And off we go. Toe, knee, chest, nut, nose, I love him. Toe, knee, nose. Toe, knee, nose. Toe, knee, chest, nut, nose. I love him. That's what toe, knee, nose. Bravo. That's so exhausting. Right, let's take it up a level. Let's leave out one of the words, shall we? So let's leave out knee. So we're going to sing everything else. We're going to do the action for knee. We're just going to leave out singing it. Okay? Everybody got that? Let's give it a go. And off we go. Toe, chest, nut, nose. I love him. Toe, nose. Toe, nose. Toe, chest, nut, nose. I love him, that's what toe knows. Bravo 
everyone, well done. See if you can try this week playing with somebody and missing out some of the other words as well. Really great work, let's have a seat, shall we? Some of you may have already got it that our instrument this week is the French horn. A long time ago, the horn would have been used mostly in hunting, and it would have told the time, called the direction of the hunt, and even shown where some of the animals were. If it weren't for composers like Mozart, the horn wouldn't have done very much else. But luckily for us, it just so happens that one of Mozart's best friends was a horn player. So we're going to be joined this week by our friend Elspeth in the orchestra, and she's going to play as the last movement of Mozart's horn concerto number no. four. Some of you will recognise this melody, but in case you don't, here is a quick little song so that you will always remember how it goes. I once had a whim and I had to obey it To buy a French horn in a second-hand shop I polished it up and I started to play it In spite of the neighbours who begged me to stop Well, I certainly won't be begging Elspeth to stop. So listen out in the main melody of this music to see if you can hear all of the hunting horn sounds and listen out as well in the strings to see if you can hear some of the dogs bounding about. Thank you. 
for playing for us and thank you all for watching. There's lots of music that imitates real life sounds. Birds, ocean waves, church bells and even car horns are all in pieces of music. So let's be explorers this week. Let's go out into our local areas or listen out in our homes for some real life sounds that we can copy on our instruments. And once we've found those sounds, we can use some of the tools that we've been developing over the last few weeks of Music Box to help turn those into music. Have fun on your explorations and do share with us everything that you find. Stay safe and see you next time. <laughs>